Welcome to Tip Up, quick tech tips so you can work smarter. Like the saying goes, a picture is worth a thousand words, or in many cases, a screenshot. Sometimes taking a quick screenshot of what's on your computer can help explain something to a colleague or assist an IT technician in resolving any issue you might be experiencing. There are many ways to take a screenshot of exactly what you need, so let's get started. If you're on a Windows device, you're likely using Windows 10, which is standard across Wild Cornell. Find the snipping tool by going to your start menu or hit the Windows logo key, shift and S as a handy keyboard shortcut. With the snipping tool, you actually have multiple ways to get a screenshot. Freeform lets you draw any shape around an object. Rectangular lets you drag your cursor to form a rectangle around the area you want to copy. Window allows you to select a window like a dialog box. And full screen takes a photo of your entire desktop. After you take your screenshot, you can use the pen or highlighter buttons to annotate directly onto your screenshot. Then make sure you save it and send it off. Macs have their own keyboard shortcuts to take screenshots. To take a screenshot of your entire screen, press and hold Shift-Command-3. For just a portion of your screen, hit Shift-Command-4 and drag the crosshair to select the area of the screen to capture. To move the selection, press and hold the space bar while dragging it on the screen. Press the escape key if you just want to cancel the screenshot altogether. If you press Shift Command 4 and also press the space bar simultaneously, that allows you to take a screenshot of a menu. Every time you take a screenshot, a thumbnail appears on the bottom right of your screen. Select it and you'll be taken to a window where you can annotate your screenshot with text and pen tools. All screenshots are automatically saved to your desktop with the date and time you took it. Want more tip up? Watch our videos and submit your ideas at its.wild.cornell.edu slash tipup.